Hey everyone, I wanted to do this a quick review video on the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette, which looks like that. It comes with six colors, and the idea behind this palette is to have them all matte shadows, which, like a matte palette, since the Urban Decay ones are mostly shimmery and stuff. I'll show you side by side. A naked palette looks like this and this is the side of the Naked Basics palette which is way smaller. The reason behind this is to be all matte shades but this one which is the first one which is called Venus is actually a shimmery shadow but the rest are definitely matte. The second shade here called Foxy you could actually find in the Urban and the Naked 2 palette which is the first color right here which I am uh, dug deep into this color so I really like that it comes in the Naked Basics palette the retail value of this palette is $28 and you can purchase this at Ulta um, Sephora and Urban Decay Cosmetics UrbanDecay.com um, it has a black which is called Crave this brown shadow which is faint which is like a dark brown which is like one of my favorites that I like to use in the crease to darken it up my eye. Naked 2, which is like this lighter brown. WOS, which is Walk of Shame. And this one's like a pinky color. Foxy, which is a yellow undertone. And this Venus, which is like a shimmery color. Is this palette worth it? I say it is because $28 you cannot go wrong with neutrals or matte shades. I mean, I use this palette every day. I've been using it every day since I've gotten it. Either if it's all the colors together or like today where I just use it to like, what's it called? I was going to say contour. Where I used to deepen up the crease or to give it more dimension or whatever, you know, our blending color or just an all over lid. I usually use all these five shades unless I'm going for like a dramatic color, then now the black will come in handy. But I use this palette every day. I keep it on my vanity because it's easy to reach and it's easy to take on the go as well. I really think it's worth it. Definitely think you guys should try it out as well. I don't have any complaints about it. The packaging is sturdy. It's sleek. It just says naked. It's more of a plastic and not of a tin like these. And also you get the same size eyeshadows as the actual naked palettes. So if you see them side by side, they give you the full size from the Urban Decay naked palette from the basics. They're exactly the same sizes, so it's not like you're getting ripped off or anything. I think it's a good deal. Definitely go out and try it out for yourself. If you like neutrals, it's a nice cheap palette. If you're into the naked palettes like I am, I love all of them. Honestly, I use them a lot. And this is now like my favorite out of all of them because it's like my go-to everyday palette. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick review. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Have a wonderful day, and remember you're beautiful. God bless. Bye.